All right. Welcome back to another Yakuza Zero. We just got through with Club Mercury and their Old Spice. Uh, we're going to kick straight on and we're going to start taking on Club Venus. We've got a whole bunch of Platinum Girls now. About four of them. Although, I think it's Hibiki in the blue. She's quite low level, but still. She can only work one shift at a time as well, which kind of sucks. Nonetheless, grab your drinks, kick back, relax, uh, enjoy the show. Majima and Club Venus is about to get it. Let's check it out. Let's go sneak a peek at Kanehara's Club Venus. Good idea. Then let's... Mysterious... Who's mysteriously laughing? Where's that laughing coming from? What the crap? <laughs> ah, speak of the devil. It's me with my cool haircut. And you are? What? Me? It's me. I have no idea who me is. <laughs> who are you? I wouldn't know who it is unless it didn't have his name there. Probably could have figured it out though. You don't remember me? You don't remember this beautiful face? Hmm, should I get it wrong? <laughs> nah, let's get it right. I know who you are. Are you maybe Club Venus's Kanehara? <laughs> of course. Ho oh, ho. Exactly. Please don't give me such a fright. I'm sure not even the dumbest of beasts could forget my beautiful face. <laughs> You're really getting on my nerves. Whatever, what's your business here at Club Sunshine today? Kanehara of the five stars. Well, it's not really five anymore, it's two now. <laughs> A little birdie told me you guys were going to be scoping out my club. Wait, what? We just said that. Are you the little birdie? Hiding outside my door? Listening to us? Figure to be proactive and come check you guys out first. And what little birdie was that? You want to cut to the chase or keep bullshitting me? <laughs> You're such an amateur, Majimakun. It's the very definition of amateur hour in here. I think we got a pretty good club. My lady, your performance is at the end... Is at an end. Come back home to me. Wait, what? Here's kind of her. What? Wait, who are you? What? The job well done, my little spy. I've already reserved this room at a nice hotel with a beautiful night view. Oh, I can't wait. Who is she? Have I actually seen her before? Did you steal the things I asked for? Yes. Club Sunshine's customer data, details on the girls, financial data. I got it all. Majima, punch her in the face right now. Just. She's not even looking. Clean. Knock her drawer off. Take your stuff back. Wait a minute. Yoda chan I can't be. Oishi san was a spy. Did I remember her? He handed me all that confidential info without a second thought. It was like taking candy from a baby. It sounds like a larf. We got played like a damn shamisen. I don't know what that is. You should have known I'd do anything to pry the upper hand from my opponent. That's the only way to keep winning this life or death game, Goro. I appreciate the lesson, Kanahara. <laughs> Such humility is, is rare in fools. You truly know your place. Man, fuck this dude. He's cheating. Oishikun, can you take care of the data uh, analyst after you get back? I want juicy details on every weakness. You got it. Anything else from mm. me? Well, that depends on what you find on the data, but how about making a few calls and extend our little hotel stay? It was just the two of us, of course. He gonna get laid with pleasure. Oh, there will be pleasure. Copious amounts of pleasure. <laughs> that hair can do things to you that you could not even imagine. That was simple enough. Women are so amazingly foolish. You're a special kind of scumbag, aren't you? Mm. I'll take that as a compliment. Speaking of scum, though, I must say this seedy little club is quite fitting for you. A seedy exterior, a seedy owner. Everything here is so seedy I can smell it in the air. I think it's classy. I even color coordinate it to match sunshine. Motherfucker. Really, you should be honored that someone of my stature would, des uh, would deign or even set foot in this club. Want to give it a rest with the lame insults? Oh yeah, Yuki's gonna get mad. You wouldn't like her when she's angry. I don't know about majiba Sam and the rest of the team, but I'm not seedy. <laughs> she doesn't know about the rest. Come on. How can you get to be the only one who ain't seedy? Yeah, exactly. Because, <laughs> amazing, a jewel among the refugees. Hey, leave us alone. Mm. What a beautiful woman. Yes, yes, you're talking about Aichan, right? I know how this goes. I'm not going to fall for it this yep. time. 
No, it's you, my dear. What is your name? You really mean me? My name is Yuki. No, don't talk to him. Yuki, do you want to be my lady? No, she doesn't. I can pay you three times the peanuts you're earning here and grant you the priceless pressure of sleeping with me. This dude just fucks everyone left, right and center. Think about it. Instead of wasting away in a dump like this, you could be living the love of luxury at my side. No way. That a girl, Yuki. That a girl. What did you say? I said no way. You're not my type. The furthest thing from it, actually. So absolutely not. <laughs> no, I didn't like that, did you, punk? What a tease. I like you. Now I really need to make you mine. You found a new girl to toy with? Ah, this is my next... My next platinum girl. Chica. And only moments after you manipulate another girl to do your dirty work for you. Even though she's spying for me, well, she might have been the sharpest on the shed, but she was the right tool for this job this time. Who's that? That's Chica Chan. She's the number one hostess at Club Venus. Of course, that was self explanatory. Is she? She's a beauty, and no doubt she's got what it takes to earn that spot. He's already eyeing her off, like, yeah, I'm gonna get her. She's, she's mine now. She has a mysterious air about her that just turns men into jelly. She says, she's, oh, they say she's one of the top girls in Sultan Body. The rumor that she's going out with Katahara son seems to be true as well. You really up to yours. Yeah, you really know everything, don't you? Women are like pawns, Chica. What's important is to move them in the right positions to make them fulfill their potential. And when a girl has no more value to you, you throw it away without a second thought. But of course, and one day, I'll surpass Tukiyama kun with strategy. Just you watch. I can't let something as silly as sentiment get in the way of my ambitions now, can I? He's got a point about that. Emotions make you weak. I know. I just need to make sure I don't get thrown away too. Don't worry about things like that, Chica. I would never throw you away. That's bullshit. As long as you're the number one girl in my club. Yeah. <laughs> this is a condition. I have to work harder then. Yeah. Fucking better. Off to work. Go on. Skedaddle. Let's get out of here. Who are you talking to? She's already gone, dude. <laughs> You'll be mine, Yuki. I promise. <laughs> I always get what I want. <laughs> you will be my girl. Oh, yes. You will be my girl. Ta-ta! I think I just threw up a little in my mouth. You said you were such a big hit with him. You did it. I'm not exactly happy being a hit on that creep. Guy's more twisted than a pretzel. There you go. Kind of her and chicken from Venus. Uh, at least things are staying interesting. Alright. I guess I don't have to go check it out. I will just um, open up for business for another night. And uh, we'll probably get more fans and move on then. <laughs> Congratulations. We now have more than 3,000 fans from the Club Venus area. Nice. We're making Ooh. great progress, I would say. I bet Kanahara hears that news. When he hears the news, it'll wipe the smile right off his face. Fucking better. Cheeky bastard. Sure hope so. And he's back. <laughs> it's me. Yes, we know it's you. It's a really reflective button he's got on his jacket. Look at that. You finally managed to remember my name. I'm so happy. I remembered it before. Uh, what do you want? Making a stop the drop. A declaration of war or something. Aww. Me against you? How quaint. Predators don't declare war on their prey, they just eat them. I simply came to see Yuki. <sighs> Are you ready to come be my lady? Don't fuck. Don't you talk to my Yuki. I will whoop your ass. What are you talking yeah. about? You know exactly what I'm talking about. There's never been a woman who's refused me. Come, this is the beginning of our grand adventure together. <sighs> Knock it off, you fucking punk. <sighs> I'm never going to like you. Just leave me alone. I <laughs> see. You're cute, Yuki. I've never been denied like this in my life. So this... This is as amusing as a novel. I just had like a mini stroke again. I tend to have that when I have to read in copious amounts. <laughs> uh, maybe I said this already, but I don't stop until I get what I want. If I can't have it, I'll make sure no one else can. I don't want you to be unhappy, Yuki. I want you to live in my arms. You really should stop teasing me so much. You know I'd be very sad if you weren't here. Jesus, is he threatening to kill her? Ta-ta, Club Sunshine. I look forward to your continued, albeit futile, efforts. Who the fuck is this guy? Get the fuck out of here, you skunk. What a dick. 
You can join you, okay? I'm fine. I won't let him intimidate me. Ah, that's good to hear. Great to hear. You protect me if anything happened, right? You know I got your back. Bang. Nice little point at her as well. Real sort. Oh, you two? Oh, you, you were all gonna fight. <laughs> nice. Hopefully we get some like some of those more team heat moves and we fight with these guys. Oh, Yuki's a little bit worried. Her eyes are shifting. Yuki's voice is still trembling, but she's trying her best to be brave. Just means I've got to stop Kanahara from having his way. Yeah, it's time to fuck that guy up. Well, having said that, <laughs> I've got to do another another business night. So, yeah, we'll do that. We'll come back and then we'll fuck up this sleazy skunk. Congratulations, top 5,000 fans. Good job, Yoda-chan. He didn't do anything, it was all me. Club Venus ain't going to be able to ignore us after this. So I'm sure that host wannabe will be here soon to challenge us. Excuse me. Ah, uh, yeah. Right on cue, as always. Wait, ain't you Chica from Club Venus? What do you want? I have a message from Kanahara here. A challenge from Club Venus. Challenge a cabaret battle. Uh, is Yuki-san here? Uh-oh. What can I do for you? Yuki-san, please don't take this personally, but if I were you, I'd get out of here as soon as you can. What does that mean? A man I know well has been acting a little strange lately, and I don't know. I just have a really bad feeling. I think he may be plotting to kidnap you, Yuki. Oh, shit. Please, you have to be careful. When you say he, you don't mean... Oh, <laughs> what's the big idea? Trying to scare Yuki-chan? Uh, you trying to throw her off a game so you can get a leg up in the cabaret battle? Is that it? Is it, bitch? Hmm? Mm -hmm. No, that's not it at all. He really would do anything to get what he wants. He's a dangerous man. I don't want to see any more girls hurt by him, that's all. If Kanahara catches you, you're going to have a bad time. If Kanahara catches you, you're going to have a bad time. She should have pizzaed, not french fried. So, you can um, please go somewhere safe for now. I won't be intimidated like that. Yeah, that a girl. Be strong. I'm a member, member of Club Sunshine. I'm going to fight beside Majima, Yoda, and I. Fuck you. Yeah. And the other girls that we don't talk about. <laughs> I mean, I know I'm still an amateur, but I might not have much to contribute. That doesn't mean I'm going to run away. Yuki Chan, you're one of my best girls. What do you mean you don't contribute much? Uh, everyone here has my back. I'm not afraid of Kanahara. I see. I wish you'd believe me, but please be careful. Removing someone from the equation comes all too easily to him. Man, fuck this dude. Uh, I wonder if she was really worried about me. Sound like she was a little bit. <laughs> if she actually meant it, then I was pretty rude to her. Well, who knows, maybe Kanahara told her to say those things to scare you. We'll know soon enough. Looks like we'll be going up against Kanahara any day now. Oh, just, Yoda's just walking away. Yes, you're right. But she was so calm before, and today she seemed almost desperate to warn me. What is Kanahara up to? Well, there's never any... There's never any harm in being more careful. You watch yourself, right. Yuki-chan. Oh, and Yuki-chan, you were pretty cool back there. You've come a long way. <laughs> pretty, you were pretty cool, Yuki. Uh, really, who laughs like that? <laughs> Don't do that. Quit laughing like a cartoon and can't help right. me with this. Kanahara, what are you really up to? Welp. You know what time it is? Oh. Uh oh. I can't believe it. Someone sent me out to fetch vinegar. <laughs> Jesus, she's gonna get kidnapped. Are you some from Club yeah. Sunshine? Oh shit, she's getting kidnapped. I'm not gonna be able to use her for this battle. Fuck. Hundred percent. Have you seen Yuki? Nope. That's strange. She went out for some errands, but hasn't come back yet. I wonder if she stopped by somewhere. Yuki Chan loves dessert, so maybe she's having a snack somewhere. Uh, fucking bet you it is. That fucking skunk's trying to steal my girl. Let's give her a little more time. Uh, agreed. We'll have to make do with the other staff members until she comes back. But I'm worried, though. We'll be going against Club Venus soon. yuki chan has gone missing. She will not be in the staff roster until she returns. So I'm not going to be able to use her to fight them. God damn it. Um, okay. Well, I'm going to do one more little business rest up my main girls so that when I take on Club Venus I've got all my 
Platinum Girls. So come back and we will take on Club Vinols. All right, here we go. That hysterical laughter. That laugh again. <laughs> there it is. Hey there, Majibakun. Looks like you work pretty hard in your seedy little club. How are you doing? Can't complain, I guess. How about you? Your club's losing fans, but you look like you're doing okay. <laughs> no thanks to you, but now that I look at you, I have to say, you look like a, you look a little concerned. Is something the matter? Mm. It's always as if one of your girls in your club has gone missing, you motherfucker. <laughs> what have you done with Yuki-chan? <laughs> now, Majibakun, I have no idea what you're talking about. Bullshit, you piece of shit. I told you before, didn't I? I always get what I want. You son of a yeah, you tell him. Imagine when you punch him right in the dick. The timing is almost is most unfortunate, isn't it? Based on your analysis, it seems that Yuki Chan is your club's main girl. Of course she is. She's been here from the beginning. Uh, with this main attraction out of the picture, what hope does Club Sunshine have of winning against us? You know, we could always postpone the battle until later if you get down your knees and beg for it. How about that? How slimy can this pond scum get? <laughs> pond scum. Uh, what should we do, Majima? We're at a real disadvantage without Yuki. Nah, we can do it. Let's do the battle. Yes. Sure to be tough without Yuki here, but with all of us working together, we'll be able to handle a weasel like this. Besides, if Yuki were in our shoes, I bet you'd want to stick around and fight. No. Fuck yes, you would. Caving into a man like this won't do anyone any good. Majima, let's do this. Let's win and get oh. Yuki back. I'm in. I'm all in. <laughs> all fucking in. Let's go. Quite an inspirational little speech. I'm fired up. Shall we start the Cabaret Club battle then? It's showtime. Alright, you motherfucker. Let's do this shit. I don't need Yuki to win. I've got heaps of platinum girls. You want Saki? I'll, get, I'll give you Saki. So Saki gets requested, like, personally a lot since I've been taking on Club Venus. Alright, this old bird's also one of my best girls. <laughs> oh, what you need, girl? What you need? Need a towel? I got you. Your fresh towel? Madame? Sometimes I wish I was my dreamer. <laughs> Not the whole, like, almost dying from the being an executor thing, but like the rest of it seems kind of cool. Uh, do we get any more big smiles? Yeah, I'd save my platinum girls for when I need them. So I'll use my gold girls first and leave the platinums in case they get requested as well, because I don't know if they're gonna... Ooh! Dancing Venus, huh? Oh, shit! They took our girls! Motherfucker! Um, not a girls. They took our took our customers. Holy shit! This is gonna be hard. This is gonna be real hard. I need fever time. This is gonna be real hard. I didn't realize that they're gonna take our customers. Motherfucker! Can I take our customers when we're doing fever time? Oh shit! This is gonna be hard. Alright, we need some fever. Let's go. Uh, you want a towel? Got you. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. Fuck, if he takes my girl, um, my customers again. Uh, menu? Oh, he requested A. I didn't even realize. Nice, no, I saw the purple and just thought it was love. Your order? Ding! Good job, Majiba. <laughs> that thumbs up gets me every fucking time. Come on. Extender, extender. You fuck. Alright, get out. Hurry up. Ah, oh, shit. He's gonna take our people. Fuck! What? Again? Holy shit! Holy shit! 
Give that girl a reward. Oh, she's lost a lot of... So he's, he's dropping the HP of my girls as well. Fuck. This is tough. This is real tough. Oh, he's taking so much of the health. Fuck. Come on, I need some fucking fever time. Let's go, let's go. Oh, you need help? I got you, I got you. What do you need? Tower? I got you, Grandma. This is like kind of stressful because I'm worried I'm not going to win this one. Ice? Yeah, I got you. Let's go, let's go. Here's your ice, if I may. Well done. Great job! Thumbs up, great job. Shit, his meter is filling up so fucking fast. What you need? Need ladies glass? I got you, don't worry. I know all the fucking hand signals, let's go. Shit, I need heaps more fever time than this. I wonder if he can't take them if I'm in fever time. I fucking hope that's true. Oh, so my fever time is dropping his little meter. That's good. Um, what do you need? Give the girl a big reward because she's got fuck all HP left. Jesus. This guy's an absolute scum. What you need? Tower? I got you. Fresh tower coming up. I don't want to know what that tower's for. What you need? What you need? Need love? Ooh. I might, uh, I might need sucky for this. Okay, he didn't want to That kind of works for me because I think I'm going to need her in this table. Nope, that's not going to matter. I'll keep her then. Just guess someone requests her. Praise the girl. Keep her HP up. Fuck, he's about to hit another one of these things. Shit, he's about to take my fucking customers again. Oh no! I thought it was fever time. I fucked up there. He's about to hit that fever. Come on. Come on. Um, he picky chucked her down. I don't like how high his fever time's getting. This is bad. He's gonna use it any second now. I need to get my fever time so I can bring down his special meter. Good job, have a reward. Keep your health up. Keep your health up, big mama. Let's go, let's go. Keep that fever time rolling. Need it. Ice? Got you, got you. You need more help too? What you need, Saki? You need a towel? I got you, let's go. Shit. He can take like four of my fucking things, I think. Ladies glass? I'm on it. As long as he doesn't use any more of those fucking things. Need party? Apparently grandma likes to fucking party. Let's go. Good job, good job. Praise her. She doesn't need a gift. She doesn't need that much. Just praise her. Extend it, please. Yes, I needed that. I needed that. Free fever time, baby. Talk. She likes to talk. Uh, what do we got? Praise her. Keep her HP up because he he's almost got a full special time. Go, let's keep going fever, baby. Let's keep going fever. He's not using his special meter, which is fantastic for me. I feel like if he did use it whenever he got it, I'd be fucked. Uh, yep. Happy. Everyone's happy. 
Just don't take my shit. There's less than 10 seconds. Damn it, he took it. But I'm fevering. Oh, he just took three of them. That's okay, it was last second. What a motherfucker. I think I beat him. I fucking smashed him. You're a little bitch. You're a little bitch, Club Venus. That's what I fucking do. Oh, suck he's max level now. What are you gonna do about that? Woo, S rank, baby. Fuck yeah, what do you got to say about that, you little punts? How could I possibly lose to these losers? Me? You? You're a fucking twat. Club Sunshine ain't even got warmed up yet. You had enough? Justice always prevails. Fuck yeah, it does. Inconceivable. Just like your face. Yeah, you're not happy now, are you, little bitch? I wasn't supposed to lose. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> I haven't taken him down yet. It's okay, Kanahara. Let it go. I stood with you in your pursuit to surpass Tsukiyama-san, no matter how single-minded and even... Oh, maniacal. Maniacal, is that how say it? Fuck do I know. Uh, I know you're doing anything to achieve that, but it's time to let it go. I don't want to see you suffer anymore. Let the weight fall off your shoulders and let's walk out of this. Are you okay with that? I guess that's a uh? yes. Don't you mess with me. No, apparently he's just a straight up dick. Uh? I see why I lost now. It was you, Chica. You were sucking and you don't even do your job. I would never. It was you, not me. I did nothing wrong. I let you be with me because I thought you'd be useful. And this is how you repay me? I don't need you anymore. Uh? Get the hell out of here. I don't ever want to see your face again. You're an absolute dick. No. Yeah, how could you? This is so wrong. Chica did her best uh? for you. Shut the hell up. You don't know shit. This can't be the end of the line for me. How could you possibly understand the pressure I'm under? Majima, I won't take this line down. Come out and fight me. Oh, fuck yeah. This is what I wanted, to fight him in the end. Uh, I don't care about what anyone thinks of me. Nobody's going to stop me. You're mine, Majima. Fine, but when I win, you're going to give me Yuki back. Fuck yeah. Let's beat his ass. Bring it on, you fucking piece of shit. Yeah, how you like that? Yeah, like a fucking kick you across the fucking alleyway. Let's go. You fuck, you wish, bro. You fucking wish. I'm gonna smash it over your head. I don't do anything. Do whatever I want to you. Cause you're a bitch. Eat like beer crates, huh? I like that. I call this one the spinner Rooney. You little punk. Fuck yeah. This guy sucks. Yeah, nice three hit combo. Come on, come on. Harakarana, you're dead. You are fucked, mate. You are fucked. Oh shit, he got behind me. Oh, big punch, huh? Big punch for a big boy. Big boy, huh? Big boy. Big fucking boy. How about this? How about I cave your fucking skull in? How's that sound? Eat the vending machine, you little prick. I hate this guy heaps. <laughs> he's, a, he's a little twat. How can I get into a bunch of losers like you? I don't know if you know, but I'm ex-fucking Yakuza. I whoop your ass in every aspect. You're the one treating others like you're on personal prawns. And you call us losers? Huh? Oh, he just fucking sprang up to his feet. I won't accept it. I demand we do it over. How pathetic, Kanahara. The last fucking dude. Yeah. Tsukiyama. <sighs> I think that a pitiful wretch like you... To think a pitiful wretch you like you was once considered number two among the five stars. I suggest you remove yourself before you cause me any further embarrassment. That's right, get the fuck out of here. I only wanted to surpass you. Never in a million years. Now, not another word. You are useless and I want to get out of my sight. <laughs> the dude in the background that walked in and saw that what was going on was like, no, nah, fuck that. Just turn around and walked away. If you don't, I'll make some arrangements. Ah, he knows what that means. Take it easy, bruh. Tsukiyama, it's been a while, Majima-san. 
my humble apologies if my inept minion actually managed to cause you trouble. <sighs> he was your crew, wasn't he? You want to call yourself the boss? Then you've failed just as hard. <laughs> what can I say? I'm embarrassed. In any event, defeating Club Venus, that's quite a feat, my dear son. Thought, uh, though I expected nothing less from the manager of the cabaret grand. Oh, he knows. First it was Hino and now Kanahara. I'd say the five stars aren't twinkling so bright anymore. <laughs> to be frank, I hardly care about the five stars. If it goes bust, it's truly a non-issue. Kanahara in particular became quite conceited after he got a little power and money. I knew I would have to get rid of him at some point. <laughs> and you did that just for me, Majima-san. I can't thank you enough. But sooner or later, I may have to step in and fight you myself. Call it a gut feeling. <laughs> it's mutual, so I think is what that said. I look forward to the day when... I looked forward to the day then that I can personally put an end to you along with Club Sunshine and Cabaret Gran. You're not going to be a big Cabaret Gran. It's run by Yakuza, you fucking idiot. Looks like we'll be up against Tsukiyama soon. Majima-san. So I just realised, Tsukiyama... He owns Club Moon. Tsuki is moon in Japanese. Mind freaks. Uh. Mind freaks. <laughs> I'm really uh. sorry. Yep, this is the part where you fucking join us. Yep, you're really disappointed in him. I get it. Come work for us. We don't got Kanahara. Yeah, just come work for us. Work your ass off. I'll buy you new clothes. We'll go to karaoke and shit. It'll be great. If you come aboard, you'll find yourself smiling more than you did at your old club. I could work with a smile. Maybe tears are a woman's weapon sometimes, but I say a smile packs a lot more heat. Come to think of it, I don't think I've smiled in a while. Work, love, both of those should have been a lot more fun. Love? Somewhere along those lines, I lost all that. That's deep. Y yes, you know who I am. We've been talking for ages. Look forward to working with you. Hey. New recruit, Chica. Let's get it. Would you look at that? You smile. <laughs> Yay. It's like the sun just busted through the clouds. You really think so? That makes oh. Imagine, but you're such a fucking charmer. I guess all is well that ends well. Uh, except where's Yuki? Good call, you guys. Yeah, are we forgetting someone? Are we forgetting about Yuki? Aren't we forgetting? So exactly, yeah. <laughs> it, could, it couldn't have been important. Oh, no. <laughs> Poor Yuki. <laughs> Just like right above us. Yuki has returned safely. Thank God. Uh, got some more slugger style. Excellent. Excellent. Oh my God. Poor Yuki didn't deserve that. <laughs> club Moon, is there any club remaining? Hi. So there's a lot of work I have to do before that. I can now take on Club Moon, press through the story and cabaret battles by increasing the number of fans in each area. Game of clothes and fan. So yeah, I've got to go do a whole bunch of other stuff. Like I go to businesses, like just random little shops, and I partner up with them to get more fans for the moon area. So I got a lot to work to do. But before I end this episode, I have one little special treat that uh, I'm going to do to send us off. So here we are back at the karaoke. We're with Hibiki, who was the girl we got from Club Mercury. Uh. There's a new song for her, which I played. So I'm going to re redo it because the lively interactions are incredible. So <laughs> a nice way to send it off after beating Club Venus and going into our battle against Tsukiyama eventually. Let's fucking get it. Oh, what a fat beat. Here we go. Uh, yeah, uh, uh, let's go. Majima's about to fucking get it. Uh, <laughs> oh, Majima goes fucking mental in this song. Baby, 
Oh my god, I love it. Oh, beautiful. Such a beautiful voice Majima has where he sounds like he's going fucking mental. <laughs> oh, well, there you have it. I just wanted to end it with that because that was too good not to share. So um, that's going to be it for this time. Come back next time and we're going to take on... Club Moon. Let's fucking go.